वेलकम टू इनोवेटिव इंस्ट्रूमेंट्स कॉन्फ़िगरेशनल पैरामीटर फॉर पी आई एट एट टू टू एंटर इन कॉन्फ़िगरेशन मोड प्रेस एंड होल्ड सेट एंड अप की सिमिलटेनियसली फॉर थ्री सेकेंड आफ्टर दैट लॉक कोड विल अपीयर डिफॉल्ट लॉक कोड इज फिफ्टीन टू एंटर इन कॉन्फ़िगरेशनल मोड प्रेस अप की टू मेक यूनिट डिजिट फाइव Press Shift key once to move the cursor to next digit. Press up key to make unit digit one. Lock code will appear as 15. Press Set key to enter in configurational parameters. Parameter one, input type. This parameter value is set according to the type of sensor connected to the controller's input terminals. If TCJ selected. Instrument will accept temperature input from thermocouple J type sensor at rear terminal. Below range it will display L L L L message and above range it will display H H H H message. If TCK selected, instrument will accept temperature input from thermocouple K type sensor at rear terminal. Below range it will display L L L L message. and above range it will display h h h h message if tcr selected instrument will accept temperature input from thermocouple r type sensor at rear terminal below range it will display l l l l message and above range it will display h h h h message if tcs selected instrument will accept temperature input From thermocouple S type sensor at rear terminal, below range it will display L L L L message, and above range it will display H H H H message. If TCN selected, instrument will accept temperature input from thermocouple N type sensor at rear terminal, below range it will display L L L L message, and above range it will display H H H H. message if tct selected instrument will accept temperature input from thermocouple t type sensor at rear terminal below range it will display l l l l message and above range it will display h h h h message if tcb selected instrument will accept temperature input from thermocouple b type sensor at rear terminal Below range it will display L L L L message and above range it will display H H H H message If RTD selected instrument will accept temperature input from PT100 sensor at rear terminal below range it will display L L L L message and above range it will display H H H H message If RTD point 1 selected instrument will accept temperature input from PT100 sensor at rear terminal below range it will display L L L L message and above range it will display H H H H message If 0 to 1 selected instrument will accept 0 to 1 volt DC input at rear terminal below 0 volt it will display L L L L message and above 1 volt it will display H H H H message if 0 to 3.3 selected instrument will accept 0 to 3.3 volt dc input at rear terminal below 0 volt it will display L L L L message and above 3.3 volt it will display H H H H message If 0 to 5 selected instrument will accept 0 to 5 volt dc input at rear terminal below 0 volt it will display l l l l message and above 5 volt it will display h h h h message if 0 to 10 selected instrument will accept 0 to 10 volt dc input at rear terminal below 0 volt it will display l l l L message and above 10 volt it will display H H H H message 
if 0 to 20 selected, instrument will accept 0 to 20 milliamperes input at rare terminal. Below 0 milliamperes, it will display L, 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 L message, and above 20 milliamperes, it will display H, 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 H message. If 4 to 20 selected, instrument will accept 4 to 20 milliamperes input at rare terminal. Below 3.8 milliamperes, it will display L, 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 L message, and above 20 milliamperes, it will display H, 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 H message. If input is less than 3.2 milliamperes, it will display loop break message. Parameter 2 Display resolution. By this parameter, user can select display resolution. This parameter will not appear for thermocouple and RTD sensor. Display resolution equals to 0. Display resolution equals to 0, 0.0. Display resolution equals to 0, 0.00. Display resolution equals to 0, 0.000. Parameter 3. Lower set point limit. Sets the minimum limit for set point adjustment. It can be set from minimum specified range of selected sensor to HSPL value. This parameter will only be prompted if input type is thermocouple or RTD. Default LSPL value is 0. Parameter 4. Higher set point limit. Sets the maximum limit for set point adjustment. It can be set from LSPL value to maximum specified range of selected sensor. This parameter will only be prompted if input type is thermocouple or RTD. Default HSPL value is 400. Parameter 5. Analog input low value. This parameter will only prompt it for analog input. By this parameter user can define low scale for input signal which can be in between minus 1999 to analog high default analog low value is 0 parameter 6 analog input high value this parameter will only prompt it for analog input by this parameter user can define high scale for input signal which can be in between analog low to 9999 Default analog high value is 1200. Parameter 7. Analog input logic. By this parameter user can select the logic of the analog input. If direct selected, then the analog input value will vary from analog input low to analog input high. If reverse selected, then the analog input value will vary from analog input high to analog input low. Parameter 8. Process value offset. Function of this parameter is to add and subtract a constant value from the measured process value to obtain final process value for control applications. Default process offset value is 0. Parameter 9. Input filter. Controller is equipped with an adaptive digital filter which is used to filter out any extraneous pulses on the process value. Filtered process value is used for all process value dependent functions. If process value signal is fluctuating due to noise, increase the filter time constant value. Default input filter value is 4. Parameter 10. User lock code. Default user lock code is 15 to access configuration and alarm list. User has a choice to set its own user lock code between 1 to 9999. This is to prevent unauthorized access of configuration and alarm list. Default user lock code value is 15. Run mode. Alarm mode for PI882. To enter in alarm mode, press and hold set and down key simultaneously for 3 seconds. Press up key to make unit digit 5. Press shift key once to move the cursor to next digit. Press up key to make unit digit 1. Lock code will appear as 15 
press set key to enter in configurational parameters. Parameter 1, alarm 1 type. For alarm output 1, user can select alarm type from low, high, and band. Low alarm, output 1 activates when, process value is less than alarm 1 set point. High alarm, output 1 activates when, process value is greater than alarm 1 set point. Band alarm, output 1 activates when, process value falls outside the alarm 1 band, with respect to alarm 1 set point in either direction. Parameter 2, alarm 1 logic. For alarm output 1, user can select alarm logic as direct or reverse. User can select direct alarm logic in which output 1 will be on, under alarm condition, otherwise off. Direct setting is generally used for audio or visual alarm output. User can select reverse alarm logic, in which output 1 will be on in normal conditions, and will be off under alarm conditions. Reverse setting is generally used for tripping the process under alarm condition. Parameter 3, Alarm 1 Inhibit. This parameter can be used to suppress the alarm 1 activation upon power-up conditions. If yes selected, from power-up, the alarm 1 system remains disabled until process value is found within the limits. If no selected, at power-up if alarm condition persists, it will enable alarm 1 output. Parameter 4, Alarm 1 Acknowledged. Once alarm 1 output is activated, User has following three options to deactivate it. If auto selected, when process value falls outside the programmed limits, alarm 1 output will be deactivated automatically. If manual selected, once alarm 1 output is activated, it remains activated until manually acknowledged by up key. If both selected, once alarm 1 output is activated, it can be deactivated either by pressing up key, or when process value falls outside the alarm limits. Parameter 5, Alarm 1 Hysteresis. It sets the dead band between on, and off switching of the alarm 1 output. Larger value of hysteresis minimize the number of on-off operation of load. This increases life of actuators like contactors. Default Alarm 1 Hysteresis value is 2. Parameter 6, Alarm 1 Set Point. If enabled, user can view and edit the Alarm 1 Set Point and Alarm 1 Band in user list. If disabled, user can only view but cannot edit Alarm 1 Set Point and Alarm 1 Band in user list. Parameter 7, Alarm 2 Type. For Alarm Output 2, user can select Alarm Type from Low, High, and Band. Low alarm, output 2 activates when, process value is less than alarm 2 set point. High alarm, output 2 activates when, process value is greater than alarm 2 set point. Band alarm, output 2 activates, when process value falls outside the alarm 2 band, with respect to alarm 2 set point in either direction. Parameter 8, alarm 2 logic. User can select direct alarm logic in which output 2 will be on, under alarm condition, otherwise off. Direct setting is generally used for audio or visual alarm output. User can select reverse alarm logic in which output 2 will be on in normal conditions and will be off under alarm conditions. Reverse setting is generally used for tripping the process under alarm condition. Parameter 9 Alarm 2 inhibit. This parameter can be used to suppress the alarm 2 activation upon power up conditions. If yes selected, from power up, the alarm 2 system remains disabled until process value is found within the limits. If no selected, at power up if alarm condition persists, it will enable alarm 2 output. Parameter 10 Alarm 2 acknowledge. Once alarm 2 output is activated, user has following three options to deactivate it. 
If auto selected, when process value falls outside the programmed limits, alarm 2 output will be deactivated automatically. If manual selected, once alarm 2 output is activated, it remains activated until manually acknowledged by down key. If both selected, once alarm 2 output is activated, it can be deactivated either by pressing down key or when process value falls outside the alarm limits. Parameter 11, Alarm 2 Hysteresis. It sets the dead band between on and off switching of the alarm 2 output. Larger value of hysteresis minimize the number of on off operation of load. This increases life of actuators like contactors. Default alarm 2 hysteresis value is 2. Parameter 12, alarm 2 set point. If enabled, user can view and edit the alarm 2 set point and alarm 2 band in user list. If disabled, user can only view but cannot edit alarm 2 set point and alarm 2 band in user list. Run mode. To enter in user calibration mode, press and hold up and down key simultaneously for 3 seconds. After that calibration lock code parameter will appear. Default calibration lock code is 7. To enter in calibration mode, press up key to make unit digit 7. Lock code will appear as a 07. Press set key to enter in calibration parameters. Parameter 1, Input Output Calibration. By this parameter user can select either input or output for user calibration. By default input is select for user calibration. Parameter 2, Low Calibration. This parameter allows the user to program low calibration values other than factory low calibration values for selected input type. With the help of up and down key, low calibration can be adjusted. Parameter 3, High Calibration. This parameter allows the user to program high calibration values other than factory high calibration values for selected input type. With the help of up and down key, high calibration can be adjusted. Parameter 4, Factory Default. With the help of factory default parameter user can cancel out user calibration and factory calibration will be loaded. If yes selected, user calibration will be cancelled and instrument will run on factory set calibration values. If no selected, there is no effect on user calibration and instrument will run as per user defined calibration values. Run mode. Thank you for watching.